Hey, what's up, YouTube? It's DJ Young with Goddess Souls. I'm gonna be showing you how to apply the Reviver to a couple of different pairs of shoes. And um, so, some of the supplies you're gonna need is, of course, the Reviver, Saran Wrap, and then I like to cut it with a little blade. And you know, optional is gloves and ice packs. Um, I don't have any ice packs with me because I don't use them, but it's optional. But um, you know, I'm gonna go ahead and show you on the first pair. And this is a pair of pink foams. So all you're gonna do is, you know, I just lay the saran wrap out, make sure you know it's good enough for it, and then you just start applying it. Now you're gonna just use a straight top. If you want, you can use a paintbrush, but you know, I just use the top. So, um, you know, I just go ahead and apply it. A good size amount. And you don't have to get every spot because when you place on the saran wrap, it's gonna spread it out evenly throughout the shoe. So, um, so this is about how much I'd apply. And then I'm going to go ahead and place it down. So now when it's like this, I'm going to go around the sides and do get those extra pieces that, that I didn't get. Now if you want, if you just want to be safe and cautious, you could tape, tape around this outer side right here just so that it don't get on the upper. Now on the upper part, I haven't seen any damage to it. Now if it's like suede or nubuck, you know, you really want to be careful because you could damage it. But as long as it don't get on the upper part, you know, you'll be fine. Like on the midsole, like 11s, you know, it's, it's been fine. Um, you know, like basically any other shoe, like if it's suede or nubuck, you know, you might want to tape it off. Or just be really careful with it so it don't damage the material. Whenever you're doing this, you want to make sure the saran wrap is really good. Now, if you're using ice packs, you want to go ahead and place the ice pack inside here, inside the shoe. Um, I don't use it because I never get sole separation, so you know, so I'm good. And that's pretty much it. That's how it should look. And uh, I'm gonna show you on some 11s as well. So it's the same process over again. You know, it's very quick and easy to use. Um, now the sessions, you know, session time varies depending on how hot it is outside, as well as, you know, how bad the shoes are. You know, some shoes are gonna be like one or two sessions, some shoes like three or four, you know, and so on. It just depends on how bad it is. Now, it works on all types of yellowing. You know, even if these were a lot lighter or a lot darker as well, you know, the time, the sessions just vary. It's gonna be like one or two sessions of his lighter, three or four, you know, I'm gonna say this is probably about four or five maybe so um, you know just same process just go ahead and apply it in the areas you're working on now the reviver is good for eight hours up to eight hours in the sun um, you know usually they're done by then but sometimes you do have to wash off and reapply it I like to do short sessions like you know 30 minutes to an hour or so outside just so they don't get too hot you know I keep the reviver on it just bring them inside to cool them off and then I take them back outside so um, you know they, they don't get no separation or anything, or anything like that so, and they stay cool throughout the day so that's about how much I would apply Then I'm just going to go ahead and place it down and then now I'm going to go again I'm going to go around the sides so like I said before you know if you want to be cautious you could tape around this midsole right here just so it don't get on the upper part. Now I don't do it because I don't see any damage to it. So, you know, there's no reason for me to tape it off. But if it's like suede or new, but you know, you just really want to be careful that it don't get on the upper because you could damage it. And, um, you know, I'm just gonna go ahead and cut it again. So like I said, if you also want to add ice packs on the inside, you know, you just go ahead and throw it in there. And you know, go ahead and place these outside, upside down so the sun's um, hitting the sole of the shoe. And um, you know, just go, so I can go ahead and show you, I still got more than half a bottle of the Reviver left over. So, you know, it's good for, I'd say about three to four pair, eight ounce, you know, double the size. And um, you know, that's pretty much it. If you have any questions, Feel free to ask. And uh, for a limited time, 
since I got all these gloves and I don't use them, I will be giving them away with every bottle that's purchased off the website. So I'm um, go ahead and go to godsouls.com and I'll give you out. Uh, I'll send you out a pair of gloves. So um, thanks for watching. That's pretty much it. Godsouls.com. Follow me on Instagram at stilldjy1. All my contact information will be below. Oh, oh, and one more thing. If you want me to do your shoes, you know, go ahead and send me a picture. Contact me through the website. You know, or send me a DM on on Instagram. Thanks for watching.